After three years, more than 1,000 days of anticipation, Chinese truck driver has finally welcomed the new generation of Scania Super Truckers. August 16, 2024, Scania held an extraordinary online launch event in China, officially introducing the new generation of super serious trucks to Chinese market. Trucks that were first released in Europe back in 2021. In China, European import truckers like Scania are often referred to as high-end truckers. The term high-enders reflects their pricing, which is typically more than double that of similar truckers from domestic Chinese brands. Those truckers are particularly popular in high efficiency transport sectors such as express delivery and logistics as well as specialty transportation markets like high radio cruise and hazardous materials the scania super truckers launched in china are tailored specifically for those markets for chinese markets scania offers seven models across four product lines G, R, R, and S. Those truckers come with various driver chains configurations, including 4 plus 2, 6 plus 2, 6 plus 2R, and 6 plus 4, with output ranging from 416 to 516 horsepower. As for the pricing in China, please refer to the imaging below. The most significant upgrade in the new generation Scania Superchargers lies in the powertrain improvement. The engine now uses the latest DW6 platform model, which changes the matter to the DOHC in the value chamber, increases some efficiency to 15%. The turbo system has also been completely upgraded, leading to a 7.2% reduction in diesel consumption. The transmission is the brand new G25 or G33 CM MT heavy box gear, featuring 14 forward gears and 8 reverse gears with the Chinese special models coming with 4 reverse gears and C and OD gears positions. The internal gears of the new transmission are wild, reducing operational resistance while also being lighter and requiring less boxy gears oil. The Scania Super Truckers are equipped with the air suspension the R756 driver axle with a mini gear ratio of 1.95, allowing for the higher speed. They are fitted with Challenge X line tires, known for their excellent fuel efficiency. So how has this truck performed in China according to the test data released by Scania China? Under the transportation route of 2,685 km between Yunnan and Guangdong province, the Scania Super 416 G4 Plus 2 has an average fuel consumption of only 26.5. 18 liters per 100 kilometers when fully loaded. This is all the information released by the new generation Scania Super Truckers in China. In the future, we will continue to pay attention to the sustained performance of this trucker in the Chinese market. If you are also interested, please follow my channel.